Blue Heart. This is an app that I reviewed with my wife not so long ago, but these guys have made significant updates from it. They watch my video and they'd like me to make another video explaining some of the updates as well. So here we are. Let's jump in and take a look at the new and improved Blue Heart. So here we are with Blue Heart. Once we jump in, it loads up and we can see what we're doing for today. So right there in the middle, we've got a new today button. So the whole interface has been changed. So here we've got the therapy that we do, a journal entry to jump in and a library entry to read. So this accumulates our experience points, as you can see down the bottom here and up the top here, we've got a streak day as well. So these are new features that have been added to keep you motivated, to keep you going. So how long can you keep your streak going? And how much experience can you rack up with these new little touches? So if we go over to therapy, we can see that all of our therapy things are here and the same, except now we've got a little checkpoint at the end of those as well. And rather than have everything on one page where you just scroll endlessly through, we've got our levels on a single page and we can go through and look at all of those. So if we go, I don't think I've done this one yet. Let's have a look at the level one checkpoint. So rate your feelings, measure your progress and help our system calculate what to deliver more of in your plan. So something to personalize it just for you. So if we hit start, how confident have you felt that you'll be able to come sexual difficulties? Have you felt about the sexual issue you're working on? And rate how you feel about yourself. So they're just little questions to get you going, get you thinking about what you've been through and how you're going working on those specific issues. How would you rate how you feel in your body? Yep. Emotionally connected? Yep. Communication about sex with your partner? Yep. Physical connected? Physical intimacy? Whoop, whoop, whoop. Checkpoint complete. So communication you can see are the biggest wins here and the physical connection. Now, all of the content stays pretty well the same. So here, as a couple, you're talking, clothed, 15 plus minutes or so. So you can see that just going back there, you've got these ones being the solo lessons, uh, no, or learn, talk, touch. So these ones you're doing touching together, talk, and touch. And as we go into these ones here, you can see these ones are solo still. So you know what you're doing, how you're doing it, and what you're going to get out of it. Even just by the little icons there as well. Now I think, from memory too, so they've, it only went up to level 12 last time I think. So now they're up to level 18. And here you can see that you're going to express yourself talking, express yourself, staying connected. So there's even more stuff available to you. And if we just jump into one, it is very much the same sort of thing once again. Hi there, and welcome to the next stage of your Blue Heart journey. You've already done so well in so moving from anxiety or discomfort. Timers process. and everything else as well. Beautifully recorded sessions, non distracting sort of background, so you can close your eyes and take your eyes off it if you need to. And even with our couples one. Hi there, and welcome to a new kind of touch session. It's still something that you're going to pay attention to your partner more than the phone itself. Now, if we go into a track, you can see how you're developing. So those little checkpoints on there at the end of each section tell you how well you're going with these things. And you can see your XP, what you've done for today, your total XP, and your partnership total as well. So how is your partner going? Because these apps should be connected via your email accounts and then so synced into your partner's one as well. How are you going with your partner on these issues? So my partner, as you can see, she hasn't done anything yet, <laughs> but that's okay. Cause we've just gotten back into this sort of thing with this new interface. So then we go back to today. Then you've got your settings up here as well. Your settings up here, which haven't changed and your journal. So this is a bit of a track of record of what you've gone through, what you've done, what you've had a look at. So, if you have done a journal entry, like I did there today, and touching your partner to please yourself. So this is today's stuff. And then you've got your library once again, full of all great little articles and 
things that relate to these things. How connect to your body. Great little 10 minute read that you can go through and finish reading there. And up the top here, you've got all different sort of topics that they cover. And so that is everything with Blue Heart. I like these new additions. Just get out of this. I like these new additions and they don't change the formula too much. They make everything a little bit more easier to find and the new things don't overshadow what already great work that they already had on there. They're just little additions, little incentives to keep you going. So you can track where your partner's at as well with the experience points as well. And maybe you can both combine to get more experience points. I don't think in a coaching app that it's gonna be really important with, oh, I need this next experience level or whatever. But the little circle one with all the different little topics that you can grow and expand on, I think that's really great because you can then choose to, well, I need more development in this section. Go read some more stuff about that. And then once you do your little checkpoint at the end of the next section, maybe that's improved and maybe that'll help you grow and become more whole in that whole thing. I think, once again, the content's fantastic in this app. It's one of the best specific apps that I've seen for anything at all. So they've done a really good job. So once again, with all these extra additions, everything's still very easy to find, easy to go through, everything loads quickly. Blue Hunt gets a nine out of 10. Anything that I wouldn't change, I don't know. It does look now a little bit more basic. I thought the design before was a lot more professional, suited the whole situation about sexual counseling. This one still does the job, but it looks a little bit more basic. But that's just my take on it. I think the menus have been greatly improved and having that bit come up for you today as the first thing that you see is brilliant. But anyway guys, that's my takeaways from the new look of Blue Heart. What do you think? Do you think these additions are anything worth doing or worth having? I personally do, because it gives you that sense of accomplishment with it as well, that more incentive to keep logging in day after day. But anyway guys, that's just my thoughts on it. I'd be keen to hear what you think about the new and improved Blue Heart. Leave a comment down below, and always remember to like, share, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.